Hey everybody, welcome to my Rambo Last Blood movie review. So as the very name implies, Last Blood, if I had to describe this movie in one word, this movie would be bloody. Uh, that Or that word would be bloody. I think this is pretty good fan service um, for people who are Rambo fans. It's kind of what you wanted to see. But one, one odd thing though, I will say about this movie, towards the end I really got the feeling of like, this is kind of like Home Alone. I, I just kept getting that image of, like, that that's what it is, except a much more sophisticated uh, version of it. Um, there were some parts where I feel like they were going, you know, trying to tug at some emotional heartstrings, but it just felt a little bit flat. Um, but it's clear, I think, that the movie is self-aware to the point where it knows what it is and knows what it's trying to do, and it's able to succeed in that. Uh, the last 20 minutes of this movie, I think... Uh, are just pure delight as far as far as Rambo fans are concerned. Um, if you're a Rambo fan, this movie's still in theaters. I know I'm, uh, I'm a bit late. Um, I've just been busy moving and taking care of a whole bunch of uh, stuff. Uh, but uh, I'm going through a bunch of films now and trying to do ca uh, play catch up. So uh, on the Star Strider scale, I would give this movie a 68 out of 100. Um, I enjoyed it. If you're a Rambo fan, go see it. If you're not a Rambo fan or a really big Stallone fan, I would say you could probably skip this one. Uh, I, I had a good time. Uh, it was a little bit slow at the beginning. Um, it's a little bit odd. Um, you know, there's a lot of, like, flawed logic. How does he get across the border like that? How do all those guys with machine guns get across the border? I guess you don't care. However, you know, I, I do feel that it's... With Rambo, this isn't like a recent thing, but it's become a bit more cartoonish. Um, I still think my second favorite one was the last one where he goes to Burma. Not this one, but the one before it. And I actually like this one better than 2 and 3. 2 and 3 I just felt were terrible movies. I love the first one. Um, And I was interested in the idea of, of him taking on these cartel guys on his home turf. But so there, there were, I, I can't put, quite put my finger on it. Maybe some, there was emotional depth or something that, that I couldn't connect with. But I had a good time. So anyways, let me know. What did you guys think? Did you like it? Did you hate it? Do you agree? Like and subscribe. Leave your comments below. And I will see you later. Okay, bye.